that the value of doing that allows us to really show tax, to really maximize the tax savings because I want to maximize that for the client because if I keep saving them more and more, they're never going to quit me. They're never going to fire me. They're just going to keep staying with me. So I want the tax plan questionnaire to be very thorough, okay? Then we go the next week, tax plan questionnaire. Can you imagine, just imagine this for a minute, developing a tax plan in written form? Ben, you ever done a tax plan, written form, change a PDF document? That would be really painful. Oh, it's, it's painful, right? That's the old way. Core V, how long does it take you to do a tax plan? A couple minutes, right? You, you can go in the break room, come back, act like you're sweating to death, like you've done all this hard work, and then you deliver that the next week. You demonstrate value and savings on the call, and you get a commitment right there to implement. And if you can get the commitment to implement, we go into a tax 101 meeting. That tax 101 meeting is basically all those strategies I just talked about, sending them the GUSTA accountable plan, setting up W-2, reviewing the RC, that's all done in the tax 101 meeting where we're beginning the implementation. We've done the substantiation work that they don't want to do, and we do it on the call as an onboarding step. And then they anticipate that that's going to happen on the quarterly.